to my paper critical studies 2 with module 5 age of anthropocene today we shall look at post feminism post feminism is a term used to describe a societal perception that many or all of the goals of feminism have already been achieved thereby making further expansions of the movement obsolete Many feminist critics use the term post-feminist to negatively describe the renewed activities, the mode of activities and positions that current and previous generations of feminists have deemed sexist or oppressive. At times, post-feminism is described as a media and publishing phenomenon or as a backlash against feminism, while at other times Post feminism is discussed as a radically new way that young women are engaging in feminist activism and theory. The term can be used as an accusation against feminist scholars whose work is seen as insufficiently feminist. Elaine J. Hall and Marnie note in their 2003 article the myth of post feminism that Post feminism rests on four pillars. Firstly, support for feminism among women decreased in the 1980s and 1990s. At the same time, support for feminism decreases there is an increase for anti-feminist sentiment. So there was an anti-feminist sentiment increasing among pockets of young women. And thirdly, Many young women feel that feminism has obtained its primary ends like the right to vote, reproductive choice for women and increased representation of women in positions of power etc. And fourthly there is what Hall calls as a no but culture whereby women do not want to be labeled as feminist. but still support feminist goals like equal pay for equal work and economic independence in this view it is not that women no longer support feminism rather it is that they no longer support the connotations that feminism has acquired some young women argue that feminism because it focuses on women's equality rather than human equality is by its very nature exclusionary and therefore a kind of humanism might be more appropriate than a feminism a sort of re-emergent feminism they often state that feminism can be defined by its hostility or indif- indifference towards men and masculinity and such critics look for moments when women say sexist things about men as evidence that the feminists are sexist as well as feminists are often accused of hating men such a position implies that loving men and wanting equality for women are goals that are in tension such a position shows a false equivalency and it argues that feminism can be anti male as opposed to anti patriarchy anti oppression anti sexism etc thus post feminism can be seen as a middle ground between feminism and anti-feminism supporting gender equality and female empowerment 